Aya. Uh, Askofu Mkuu wa ADC Bishop Chabuga na viongozi wote wa ADC Mheshimiwa Rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya Mheshimiwa William Ruto viongozi wote ambao wamekuwa hapa kwa jukwaa wamejulishwa wamenena na wengine hawakunena waamini wote siku ya leo ambao wako hapa na wale wanatazama kwa mruninga hamjambo Mirembe. Mirembe ja Yesu. Mirembe ja Nyasaye. Leo tume <laughs> ni kweli mimi ni mwana wa Hana. Asante. Leo tumekuja hapa kwa sababu ni siku kuu ya ADC kusherekea miaka tatu tangu kanisa lenu lianzishe. Na nikiangalia kwa historia mwaka wa 1945 Oktoba 24 United Nations ilibuniwa na nyinyi mukabuniwa miaka mitatu baada ya United Nations kama independent church kwa hivyo hii ni sherehe kubwa kwa sababu nyinyi na United Nations ni rika moja miaka mitatu tu ndio inaoweka tofauti lakini tumeonyesha kwamba kwa miaka hiyo yote usimamizi wa kanisa lenu umekuwa imara na mumekuwa na sheria ya kikanisa ambayo imehakikisha kwamba transition inakuwa nzuri na sasa tuko hapa siku ya leo na tuna matumaini kwamba miaka zingine tatu ziko kule mbele zinakuja <laughs> Nataka pia niwashukuru kwa sababu leo kupitia kwa archbishop wenu mumedhibitisha kwamba lengo lenu ni kusaidia wa Kenya wote bila pingamizi bila ukabila kuhakikisha wote kwanza wanamheshimu Mwenyezi Mungu la pili wanaheshimu serikali na hiyo ni jambo la muhimu sana kwa hivyo bishop this is an important message stability of a nation the peace and security of a nation is paramount we do not want to have a country where even going to church is a problem We do not want to have a country where even going to a mosque or a temple is a problem. We all need peace and stability. Na mwanzo ni vile tumeanza siku ya leo. Bishop na viongozi, I thank you for the kind words. Mimi ni wenu, but thank you for the kind words. I did not expect them. Hayo tuombe Mungu atulinde sisi sote. Kwa mambo ya kitaifa nitataja tu one phrase or two. Kuna msemo ambao wanasema corruption fights back. Yaani ufisadi haulali tu. Ufisadi ama wafisadi wakiona kwamba mlango wao unazidi kuzibwa huanza kupigana. Na mumesikia wanenaji wakisema vile NHIF ilikuwa kiporwa. Na sasa kupitia kwa bunge sheria mpya imetokea ambayo inataka ibadilishe na izibe zile mashimo. Mukiona hii kelele ambayo imekuwa it is true we have to roll out faster. Lakini mukiona hii kelele it is also because corruption is fighting back. Hawataki mubadilishe muende kwa mfumo ambao utasaidia kila watu kila wote. Kwa hivyo tuchunge sana because corruption fights back. La mwisho. Nataka tukisimama hapa kabla sijamuita rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya. Tutambue kwamba ni lazima kama taifa tuwe a nation that respects the law the rule of the law 
under the processes that are demanded by the law. Tukiheshimu bunge, tuheshimu. Tukiheshimu county assembly, tuheshimu. Tuheshimu executive, tuheshimu mahakama. Kenya itakuwa vizuri kama tutafanya vile. Na tumekuwa tukitembea, juzi tumekuwa pahali sitaki kutaja mataifa. Kubadilisha uchumi wa nchi sio kitu raisi. Tumekuwa kwa nchi hawana mafuta, hawana petroli. Public transport ime collapse. Tumeona mataifa bara la Afrika saa hizi watoto milioni mia moja hawaendi shule kwa sababu ya ghasia na vita. Tushikane kama wa Kenya tuhakikishe kwamba hatufiki kiwango kama kile. Tuepukane kabisa, tuwe na utaratibu na tuheshimu serikali, tuheshimu rais wetu wa Jamhuri ya Kenya ili ndio tuwe na manufaa tukienda mbele. Kwa hivyo yangu yalikuwa yale na mimi nataka niwaambie kusingiria Allah. Kusingiria Allah no. Kugumirane mikono no. Kabisa kabisa. Na ombogu uyundi sindambo lande kuhande vza kuye. Nonda abora aduga dundundi. Nda abora ndi. Kuhande kubuaha. Uyundi. Bas, nukuko randio. Korobabu rehi. So Allah wande bagiriza kunina misara zimbiru wako. Teleka bani. Kwa hivyo nataka sasa sote. Sijui tutakuwa na wimbo gani wa Kikristo tumkaribishe mheshimiwa William Samoi Ruto aje mbele atuhutubie Nani wapi kwaya